Today is my wedding day. June 6, 2020. Can't believe this day is finally here, our wedding day. I've prayed for this day since I was a little girl. I prayed for a pretty white dress and to be surrounded by friends and family. But most importantly, I have prayed for the man I would walk down the aisle to. I prayed that he would be kind, handsome, a lover of Jesus, a family man, and my best friend. Babe, you have so effortlessly checked off every one of those things. You are God's answer to my prayers. Love is a constant friend who will ever be right by your side. Audrey, I love you so much. I, it's crazy, and this is gonna be the best day of our lives. And love has you in its arms. It will hold you till the storms have passed. Love, like a burning star, in our hearts it cannot help but last. Hey, mommy, Steve, mom. There's nothing we made it out of my wedding dress. Oh. <laughs> Forget oh. you thought you knew before There's nothing more, nothing more So give it away, cause that's what love is I for I am, I'm a little nervous, like I have some butterflies in my stomach <laughs> When the doors of the church open and I get a seat grant Like I've, I've hid my dress from him for so long So I just want to see his reaction and finally like get to actually see him Like he's just below They've done a really good job at keeping her dress like a secret so I don't know like, anything about it. And she's gonna look great. There's nothing more, nothing more. Forget everything you thought you knew before. There's nothing more, nothing more. So give it away, cause that's what love is for. When he reads his vows, or I read my vows, I'll probably get a little teary-eyed, or when I see my dad. So it's your wedding day. I hope this book brings back as many loving memories for you as it did me. From goodnight lullabies to camping under the stars, I consider myself so blessed to have shared these moments with you. To be able to call you my daughter fills me with pride, love, and joy. Love, Dad. And then the pandemic hit, and we just decided that we didn't want to wait to get married and we were going to do it if there was two people there or 150 people it didn't matter we just wanted to marry each other here's the dark nothing in this world can break its bond and love i love you so much bud cheers to us and our forever i'll see you at the end of the aisle i'll be one i'll be the one in the white dress love your bride audrey Seeing Audrey walk down the aisle is going to be amazing, and I've been reading our vows. It's probably going to be the biggest, like most emotional part of the moment. Because that's what love is for. You are the most spectacular woman I have ever met, and you are my best friend. When I see the way you care for people, even those you barely know, I see Jesus moving. You're patient, kind, understanding, and you care so much. Your love for God shines from the inside out. Your beautiful spirit to how absolutely gorgeous you are. I remember before we were even dating, when people at church said that we would end up together. <laughs> and I would keep you out until the middle of the night in the parking lot after church band practice, just so I could talk to you. I'm glad you never got in trouble for that, at least too much. <laughs> Sorry, Stephen Donna. <laughs> From the moment we met at middle school church camp, I truly believe that a piece of my heart became yours. I promise to always work for our marriage and most importantly our friendship with a gracious heart. I promise to listen to you and be your biggest encourager. I hope that we never stop dreaming and setting new goals together. I promise to support your hobbies even when they, you get a new one every three months. I promise to sing along to whatever song comes on during our road trips, especially when I don't know the words. I promise to always challenge you and stay competitive and to never let you beat me at anything, ever, ever. <laughs> I promise to cherish you in all of the love, adventure, joy, and happiness you bring to my life. I promise to always chase after more moments with you instead of materialistic things. I promise to stand by you in the hard times and rejoice with you in the good. I know that life will hand us its challenges, but I can't wait to take them on with you as husband and wife. 
promise to believe in you always and in everything you do. I promise to do my best to learn how to lead a household and eventually be a father. I promise to stand by you and be there for you. But even when I can't be there in person, know that you hold a piece of my heart. I promise these things to you, for better or worse, as long as we both shall live.